Saudi Electricity Company has awarded five stars to Adal Shamal Integrated Solar and Combined Cycle Power Plant Project for Environment, Health and Safety Standards. The project has become one of the power plants under construction in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia to obtain a five-star rating for EHS performance from SEC. GE is providing turnkey services, including engineering, procurement and construction works, and supplying four GE 7F gas turbines, one steam turbine and four heat recovery steam generators, as well as other equipment for the project. One of the turbines at the site is the first GE gas turbine rolled out locally in the kingdom from GE Saudi Advanced Turbines, a joint venture between the Usur and GE. SEC has set rigorous CHS protocols for project sites around workplace hygiene and housekeeping, lifting heavy loads, lighting and ventilation, waste management and other areas, with regular audits conducted by the Industrial Security Department. To be granted a five-star rating, organizations not only have to meet the defined criteria but also have to demonstrate that they are continuously adhering to them. GE has dedicated site leaders, staff training programs and its own internal audits to implement and monitor EHS standards at the Wad al Shamil project. Moreover, strict measures have been implemented to enable project staff to continue working safely following the COVID-19 outbreak. These measures include thermal screening of everyone entering the site, daily active random screening of staff at site by medical personnel, daily disinfection and cleaning activities, distribution of mandatory personal protective equipment, PPE, such as gloves and masks, COVID-19 awareness sessions, prevention training and educational materials in different languages, as well as other precautions. GE won the contract for SEC's Wadal Shamil project, which also includes 50 megawatts of solar power, in late 2015. All four GE 7F gas turbines at the plant can now operate in simple cycle configuration. Combined cycle commissioning works are ongoing and once complete, the facility will be able to generate up to 1,390 megawatts of power the equivalent electricity needed to supply over 5 lakh Saudi homes.